M0FXB, welcome to my channel, Zygu X6100. As we know, the X6100 has Wi-Fi and we can turn that on in the normal way and connect using the radio settings. So we just go to, where is it, system settings, then go across to wireless LAN, select with the MFK, and then we can turn on the Wi-Fi. But that can be, you know, quite difficult at times. It's not the best Wi-Fi connection. So someone asked me, can you connect a USB to Ethernet adapter? And I can confirm that you can. The version firmware I'm running is 1.6. I'll just show you that. So just go system settings, system info, and there's my version. Exit from that. And then we'll just look here and We've got a USB connector to the host port. Uh, you don't need a, see my adapter here, it can actually hold four items, but you only need one. USB to, is it the female, you know, the, the kind of USB that you can plug into. Then the adapter, which you can buy for about four pound on most sites, which goes to Ethernet, and that's going back to my router. Just in the normal way. So this now means that we can very quickly get, get into our, you know, Linux system, operating system of the radio without re being reliant on Wi-Fi and also Wi-Fi connection can be quite poor and slow. So I will try and, and, and connect to it as well. I'll just show you on my router that this is showing up as a connected item. If you look here and I have not put the name in, it has found the name Zygu X6100 and there's the IP address and the idea is that I can use that IP address now to SSH into my device. I will have a go. So yes, it's got me to the login address. You know, I just put in the IP address. I left the port at 22, selected open. I will try the password, which is root. Let's click it here, lowercase. Root and then one, two, three. And with a bit of luck, we're in. I think we are. So that's it. It does work. Bye for now. Seven, three, all the best.